Analysts say the African woman has not disappointed. The continent is awash with women in positions of leadership in all sectors. Graka Michelle, um, Gertrude Mungela, Honorable Lamimi Nzuma, Professor Wangari Madhai. There are so many sisters on the continent. Away from liberation and into 2013, there are African countries that have been notable in allowing women a larger political space and representation. Indeed, African leaders have reaffirmed their commitments to gender equality, women rights and empowerment in both economic and political spheres following the adoption of various protocols on women. But even as leaders gathered here at the African Union headquarters in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, congratulate themselves on gains made in ensuring gender parity. The sexual atrocities committed against women in the Democratic Republic of Congo will remain a thorn in their flesh. We are basically destroying the possibility of another generation of African people in total when we, when we engage in those kind of actions. The tool we are developing for, to use to train our soldiers and the code of conduct are taken seriously because you violate women, you go home and you'll be held accountable. That, yet another challenge in the African leaders' entry as they track the progress in the 50 years of African unity. Sarah Kimani, SBC News, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.